All right, guys, this is a video I've been meaning to do for a while. I'm out here at my buddy's house in Leona Valley, California. And working on his car today. So let's take a look. Here's the car I'm working on. It is a 65 Sport Wagon. It is on 11 inch, 11 and a half inch slicks. Tall bolt with a spool. Custom built T, uh, Turbo 400 Trans. Let's take a look at the inside. Headers, aluminum radiator, everything back there. Steering column's coming out. And here's the big boy, the 488 stroker. Has an 1150 carb on there. It does have stage two TA heads on it. And then here is my red 72. Uh, the 488 came out of this car. Take a look inside. It's roll cage, gauges. Roll cage and gauges are coming out. So is that electrical box. Uh, the MSD, all that over there is coming out, going in the wagon. Here's the scoop. Has a grill in there. Grill's not 100% perfect, but I can make it work. Which is actually nice. I like it better than the one I have in my car. So I might take it off, put it on there. Okay, here's another one. It's doubling my buddy's workbench for now. It's a 65 Grand Sport. There's no motor in it right now. But there will be one going in really soon. That I'm going to be putting in. Take a look at this bad boy. It's Hugger Orange. Here's some electric fans sitting here. Uh, these are my headers that are going on my 455. It's this red one and this one. See how they're reinforced here at the bottom. So my car's lowered. Here's a bunch of parts everywhere. Timing cover over there. Rally wheels over here. More headers on the floor right here. Just sitting here everywhere. And take a look at some other stuff he has. He also has another 65 Grand Sport in his garage over here in the house. But that's a factory stage two. It's a little messy. It's been sitting for a long time, but he has everything in there. Go take a look inside the shop. The shop is a mess, I'm warning you guys now. But it's okay. Okay. Here is a 494 stroker. The pan's here. It has a dry separate dry sump boiling system on it. Then over here, here's TA stage three aluminum heads. And then TA stage three roller rockers. Check this out. The fastest, the 50th fastest. Number three. 70 GS. Automatic. Look at timing covers. The alternator. This is a Mopar manifold that with an adapter, which is this, will bolt to a 455. It's also a brand new Edelbrock manifold. I'm, that I might be getting for my 455, which I'll show you in a minute. Check this out. This Jeep has a Ford, Ford 429 in it. It's pretty cool. Lift in his shop. 
so much 455 parking those back showers over there got six quadrajets over here two there's okay let's see two four five sorry five let's take a look over here here's a 455 here now initially i had a choice between this 455 and mine which i'll show you right now this is a 72 so let's go take a look over here under this cupboard right here is another 488 stroker those ta3 stage 3 heads will be going on this motor you can see the notch piston cam in there here is a 67 gs 400 I'll show you what car this goes in. I believe it's parking this side of the house on the other side of the yard. So we'll take a walk over there and see. Here's my 455. I already did a video on this one. Now I was trying to rotate the motor and I thought, shit, it's locked up. Well, come to find out, if you take a look back here. Yeah, it's hitting when you turn so far this bolt hits the flywheel here yeah you can see it here so that means I have to take this off of this and see actually it's hitting there so I can't turn it but also I need a new flex plate because when we took it out initially we hit it with the tractor on accident trying to push it in to the shop over here and it bent the flywheel so he has a few extra ones. He's going to give me one. So let's take a look over here now. There's a, actually a flex plate. Back over there. If you can see it. Right over there. So that'll probably be mine. Here's a pretty cool motor. This is a 215 Oddfire all aluminum motor. This is going in the MG he has in the other... In the, garage over there as well next to the 65 stage 2 yeah, look at that. parts everywhere exhaust exhaust rotor cap harmonic balancer windshield wiper motors just stuff everywhere Here's my other set of exhaust pipes. They came off the wagon. Complete exhaust. Okay. So here is the 67 GS400. Let's see. Let's take a look right there 400 it's all covered up I'm not gonna cover it because this is not my car obviously so I'm not gonna do that here is a Electra 225 I don't know what year it is it's his buddies that's in Holland and over here is a 72 Centurion convertible 455 455 they all have 455s including the 400 the 400 I showed you earlier was on the stand was the 400 for this car, which is the original motor. But he just wanted to rebuild it later down the line, so he had a 455 sitting around and threw it in there. Alright guys, 